editing Celine needs like a filter or something to look like a human, but some people didn't catch the community post that I made. The title of this, The Vault Vlog. The concept of The Vault Vlog is that it is a vlog from the vault. Yes, I had another YouTube channel. Technically, it's still active. And these vlogs are vlogs that I've taken that I've never seen the light of day on this channel, but I still think that I can make them good. So that's why the quality is a little different. That's why I look a little different. In this video, there are cats, uh, cause we were cat sitting Colin's mom's cats. Um, so that's why things are a little bit different. The apartment looks different. I look different. So I just wanted to like get that said before this video. So yeah, the concert is to take an old vlog completely rip it to shreds, tear it apart, and assemble a new vlog that I think is better now that my editing skills have improved vastly. Enjoy. Well, hi. I'm in the bathroom stall at work, and I just realized I have 24 hours to learn a piece of music before our rehearsal tomorrow. So I have 24 hours basically to learn Barber's summer music which some parts of it are very, very hard and some parts are not. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go through and focus on the really hard parts, the really fast runs and everything, really tough key signatures, uh, work on following the groove to that, and hopefully I won't be a total mess tomorrow. I've already listened to the piece lots of times, and like I said, we already have had one rehearsal, so I know how it goes. I had an email from our oboist, who's the person who's organizing this whole thing. He asked me to play at the beginning of the summer, and I was already playing in the Reed Quintet, but I really wanted to play Barber Summer Music. I checked my email and saw that we have rehearsal tomorrow after work. Even though I've got 24 hours to learn a piece of music, I still have to work a shift tomorrow and go to sleep. So it's basically going to be how to learn a piece of music in an evening. I have seen the music before. I do know how it goes. It's just not a piece that I'm super, super familiar with. And it's also a piece that's very technically challenging. The key signatures are hard. The time signatures are hard. So it's a lot of things that I just need to get used to. And once I get used to, I'll get into like the rhythm of the whole thing. No pun intended. Also, the last time we rehearsed it, I had a sore throat, so I didn't even practice for that rehearsal either. It's really distracting to film when you've got cats. Here goes nothing. practicing that I need to take a break because I'm getting frustrated and I'm making mistakes and I'm not getting anything done productively. solid hours of good restful sleep because sleep is the thing that's going to help me it will make or break me tomorrow because while you're sleeping your brain goes over everything that you learned during the course of the day and hopefully by tomorrow it will be in my muscle memory it is the morning of my rehearsal i got eight hours of sleep last night give or take 
waking up a few times because of this one. <laughs> meowing at three in the morning. What I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna go to work. I'm gonna listen to it on the way there. I am going to sneak a peek of my music at work, which is maybe a conflict of interest. I'm gonna listen to it on the way to rehearsal and then I will play it in rehearsal and I'm gonna get to rehearsal maybe half an hour early to see if I can get in there to see if I can just like warm up and just review what I practiced last night. Yeah. Good. And if you can't, don't get caught.